The look and the basics of the bag are very promising, but there are some details that leave room for improvement, unfortunately. Hi, my name is Boris Mono, I'm a film editor based in Hamburg, Germany. And this is the review of the Good Bag Note. The Note is a 25 liter roll top backpack with a very sleek and almost stealthy looking design. The outer material is made out of 1000D Cordura that is PU coated. Furthermore, some of the material have this great looking webbing, although I'm not sure if this is only for looks or actually adds to the durability. The bottom of the bag is further reinforced which adds stability and protects your items when you stand it on a wet surface for instance. Continuing with some of the materials, there is a huge velcro patch on the outside, which you usually only find on military style bags to add morale patches or name tags. I find this really great and adds a lot of options to making this bag your own. On each side of the bag you can find two bottle compartments and two compression straps. In my experience, these two compression straps don't really help a lot in actually compressing the bag, but are basically just good for securing a bottle. The back of the bag, as well as the shoulder straps, do have the perfect amount of padding, meaning not too much for an urban backpack and not too little so carrying the bag is actually comfortable when carrying a lot of equipment. Furthermore, the look of the shoulder straps with these loops is something I really like. And for those of you who, like me, need quick access pouches, there are two hidden in the back. Speaking of compartments, we now go into the main compartment. As you can see, there is a bright inner lining inside, which is a huge plus, especially for a top-loading backpack in my humble opinion. As this hugely improves visibility of finding all of your stuff inside the main compartment. But the inner lining is rather thin. Therefore, I'm not sure how well this might hold up long term, especially if you have pointier or metal items, e.g. this Gorilla Pod. Inside, you find three organizational compartments. This mesh pockets for small items, a tablet or notebook compartment, and a laptop compartment for a 15-inch laptop. Unfortunately, I have to say that I dislike this laptop compartment, as the top part of the laptop is basically completely unprotected. I assume that this is probably to allow many different laptop sizes into this laptop compartment. For instance, many other laptop compartments are basically more or less tailored for the Apple MacBook Pro, while this one will actually accommodate a PC laptop as well, as the top is basically just open. But this open design leaves my computer unprotected against other items inside the main compartment, e.g. this Gorilla Pod. To close the main compartment, you have these two clips, which by design are male and female and are asymmetrical in terms of length. This way you can close the bag either like this, which is standard and I prefer, or this way. I personally do not like this look, but of course this is totally subjective. And unfortunately due to this system, there's this long strap on one side when opening and closing the bag. And I found this to get in my way when rolling the bag up and annoying me when the bag is open and I load the bag. Therefore I would have rather preferred the boring but classic way with two female clips on the opening and the male clips with adjustable straps at the bottom. And speaking of straps, this is just a personal wish and not necessarily a flaw of the bag itself. To all manufacturers, if you add a sternum strap, please make them removable. Some more small details that could be improved about this bag are the zippers and this top handle. As you can see here, the strap of the shoulder strap form the top handle and it is basically just folded over and sewn together. I wish this would have been made a little bit better as it does feel a little cheap. The two zippers for the hidden pockets also feel rather cheap and considering these are on the outside, YKK Stormguard zippers would have been the better choice. So as you can see, there are some things on this bag that leave some room for improvement with some different or better design choices and material choices, this bag could be great. That is not to say that this bag is a bad bag. The shoulder straps and the back panel 
look awesome and are very well padded or have the right amount of padding in my humble opinion. The bag fits a lot of stuff and is very easy to pack. And the velcro patch is a very nice touch that you usually only find on military bags. But those small little details like the design choice of the roll top or the material choices of the zippers left me with wanting a little bit more. And regarding the laptop compartment, I would highly recommend to use a laptop sleeve as well. So in conclusion, for my personal use, the Note needs some more improvements. But if you can live with those flaws, some of which are basically more or less personal preference, e.g. the strap system, then you might still want to take a look at the good bag Note. Check the description below for the detailed scores. And like always, if you have any more questions, please comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, click the like button. And please feel free to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell icon so you won't miss the next videos. Thanks.